During his time on earth, Jesus showed incredible kindness and amazing power. He healed many people, from those who couldn't see to those who were shunned by society because of leprosy. These miracles showed that with faith, healing can happen in amazing ways. The stories of healing in the Bible are powerful examples for us today. They give us hope that we too can experience deep healing and restoration through our unwavering faith in God. Have you ever felt broken, like something needs mending deep within? The Bible tells us God is Jehovah Rapha, our healer. If you believe he can mend your hurts and bring wholeness to your life, then let's join hands, hearts open, and stand together in faith. I'm going to lead a special prayer, channeling the mighty power of Jesus. So stay with me until the very end, and let's prepare ourselves to receive the blessings this prayer can bring. Life's path can be winding, filled with unexpected turns that leave us feeling lost or hurt. We all carry burdens, sometimes physical, sometimes emotional, and sometimes deep within our souls. But in those moments of struggle, there's a powerful truth we can hold on to. Prayer is more than just words whispered in the dark. It's a lifeline, a source of deep comfort, strength, and even deliverance. So, let's open our hearts and minds and find solace in this powerful act together. Have you ever heard a story that gives you goosebumps? In the Bible, the book of James tells a powerful tale. It says, Is anyone sick? Call for the church elders. Have them pray. Anoint with oil. The prayer offered in faith will make the sick person well. The Lord will raise them up. They remind us that faith, prayer, and healing are woven together, a powerful force we can all tap into. Sometimes when we pray for healing, we might focus on a physical ailment, hoping for a quick fix. But true healing is a beautiful tapestry, woven with threads of the body, mind, and spirit. It's a dance with the divine, where we open our hearts to God's boundless love and mercy. In that space of trust, we surrender, not just to a cure, but to a deeper wholeness, a journey guided by His perfect plan for our well-being. It's a transformation, a becoming more beautiful than we can even imagine. Let me tell you a secret. God wants you healed. Deep down, I truly believe that. Now, life throws some curveballs, some things that leave us feeling broken, lost. Maybe you've been there at a point where the doctors seem stumped, the answer's elusive. That's when I turn to prayer. Because here's another truth. With God, absolutely anything is possible. In prayer, we acknowledge our human limits, the unknowns that scare us. We realize true healing goes beyond medicine. It's about finding that deep peace, that unshakable comfort that only our Heavenly Father can provide. So let's join hands, hearts open, and let faith be our guide. Prayer for healing isn't a one-way street. It's more like a beautiful dance. We come before God, not just with outstretched hands, but with open hearts. We offer our worries, our pain, and even our flickering hope. And in return, God offers something even more precious. His grace and comfort, a warm embrace that soothes our soul. This exchange is a sacred conversation, a reminder that God desires a relationship with each of us, just like a dance partner, filled with trust, love, and a compassion that moves us both. Take a moment, Close your eyes if you feel comfortable. Can you feel the quiet hum of the universe around you? That, my friends, is the presence of God, a constant current of love and power flowing through all things, even us. As we prepare to pray for healing, let's remember this. Our prayers aren't lost whispers in the wind. They're like sending a message on a powerful wave carried by the very essence of God. We pray because we have faith, 
a deep knowing that this divine presence not only hears us, but responds in ways both big and small. So let's open our hearts and let our prayers rise, riding that wave of faith to meet the healing power of God. Now, healing isn't always a linear path. Sometimes it's a dramatic shift, a sudden burst of sunshine breaking through the clouds. But other times, it's a quiet walk along a healing stream, one pebble at a time. The important thing is we walk that path together, hand in hand with our faith. Because prayer for healing is a powerful act, a declaration that we believe in a God who is more than just a healer, but a loving companion on this journey. He cares, He restores, and He walks beside us every step of the way, no matter the twists and turns. So let's pray with trust and unwavering faith for the healing we all seek. There's something powerful about gathering together, isn't there? Like vines reaching for the sun, we support and uplift each other. As we bow our heads in prayer today, let's open our hearts wide, ready to receive God's grace in whatever beautiful form it chooses to take. Maybe it's a surge of strength, a whisper of peace, or a renewed sense of hope. Let our prayers be bridges, ones that connect the struggles we face here on earth with the unwavering promise from above. Comfort, strength, and the ultimate restoration of our wholeness. So let's pray. Let's pray with unshakable faith, with a wellspring of hope, and with a deep, abiding trust in the God who heals. Because together in this act of faith, we are stronger. My friends, the beautiful thing about prayer is it's not a performance. It's a heartfelt conversation with the divine. So, whether you shout your worries to the heavens or whisper them softly, that's perfectly okay. Right now, I'd like to offer a prayer together, a bridge we can all walk across, connecting our hopes and needs directly to God's healing love. But here's the thing, this prayer is just as powerful if you pray it on your own, in the quiet moments of your day. So whether you join me now or pray these words later, know this, your faith is what matters most. Let's open our hearts. So, let's bow our heads together in prayer. Dear Heavenly Father, we come before you today, overflowing with gratitude for your love and grace. You are the source of all creation, the very essence of life and wholeness. Your majesty is awe-inspiring, your power unmatched. We call upon you, Jehovah Rapha, our healer and restorer. You mend what is broken, you revitalize the weary. Your compassion knows no limit, and your power to heal is boundless. In your hands, what is frail becomes strong, what is lost finds its way back to wholeness. With unwavering faith, we place our trust in you, believing in your ability to heal our bodies and mend our spirits. Lord, we come before you today, humbled by your majesty and overwhelmed by your love. You are the source of all that is good and beautiful, the artist behind the masterpiece of creation. Your works inspire awe in our hearts, and the miracles you orchestrate in our lives leave us speechless. We thank you not just for the countless blessings you've showered upon me, but for the abundance of love, joy, and strength you've poured into the lives of everyone I hold dear. Your grace and mercy are like the air we breathe, sustaining us, surrounding us, a constant reminder of your presence. We are forever grateful for your unwavering love and care, a love that chases away darkness and replaces it with your radiant light. Father, we all stumble on this path of life. Sometimes the missteps are small, a fleeting moment of impatience, a harsh word that leaves a sting. Other times, the burdens we carry feel heavy, the weight of our mistakes pressing down on us. For those moments, for the times we've fallen short of your glory and haven't lived up to the best version of ourselves, we ask for your forgiveness. We confess our shortcomings 
the transgressions that cloud our hearts and create distance between us. You, in your infinite wisdom, offer forgiveness freely, a gift of love so immense it takes our breath away. And so, as we seek your pardon, we commit to following your example. We extend forgiveness to those who have wronged us to release the bitterness and resentment that can fester within. Grant us the strength to forgive, Father, just as you forgive us. May your love be the bridge that mends broken relationships and sets our hearts free. Life can be a wild ride, Father. Sometimes we find ourselves on paths riddled with uncertainty, shadows lurking at the edges. We fear the darkness, the unknown that threatens to pull us under. We come before you today, Lord, seeking your protection. Shield us from harm, from the evil that creeps in and the darkness that tries to steal our joy. Deliver us from accidents that can derail our journeys and negative incidents that leave us feeling lost. Lord, as we face battles within ourselves, temptations that whisper promises of fleeting pleasure. Guide our steps, Father, towards the path of righteousness. Lead us away from those alluring detours and onto the road you've paved with love and light. Grant us wisdom, Lord, the kind of wisdom that comes from spending time with you. The wisdom that discerns your voice amidst the noise and guides our choices with clarity. With your wisdom as our compass, we can walk in your ways, living a life that reflects your love and truth, a life that is a testament to your unwavering presence in our hearts. Our God is Jehovah Rapha, the healer, the mender of what is broken. And as we stand here today, some of us carrying burdens of illness, some with unseen hurts, we come before you, Father, with open hearts and unwavering faith. Place your healing touch upon every aspect of our being. Lord, not just the physical body, but the deep well of our emotions and the very core of our spirits. We know you can heal it all. In the name of Jesus, we choose to believe. We choose to believe that your power is greater than any disease, any discomfort, any pain that tries to hold us back. We rebuke sickness, disease, anything that disrupts the wholeness you designed for us. We declare with unwavering faith, complete healing and restoration. We envision your healing light coursing through every cell, every organ, every fiber of our being. Let it flow like a cleansing wave, washing away anything that is out of alignment with your perfect plan. This healing, Father, is not a magic trick. It's a partnership between you, the divine healer, and us, your children, choosing to believe in the power of your love. Fill us with the strength to endure the journey, the trust to surrender to your will, and the unwavering faith that knows you are always working for our good. Jehovah Rapha, our healer, we come before you today not just for the healing of our bodies, but for the restoration of our minds. Some of us carry burdens unseen, battles fought in the quiet corners of our thoughts. Depression, a heavy cloak that steals our joy. Stress, a relentless chatter that clouds our peace. Anxiety, a tight grip that constricts our breath. But you, Father, are our refuge, our anchor in the storm. In the name of Jesus, we choose to claim victory over these afflictions. We rebuke the darkness that tries to control us, depression, stress, anxiety, worry, addiction, every struggle that seeks to dim our light. Fill us, instead, with your peace, a peace that transcends all understanding, a peace that settles deep within our souls, washing away the anxieties that try to steal our strength. Let joy be our fuel, Lord, a wellspring of resilience that propels us forward. Surround us with your love, a shield against negativity, a fortress of hope. Renew our minds, 
Father, with your strength and your promises, we break the chains of these afflictions, replacing fear with unwavering faith, despair with the bright ember of hope, and addiction with the sweet freedom of living in your truth. In your mercy, restore our mental health piece by piece. Guide us along paths of recovery. Equip us with the tools we need to build resilience. May we emerge stronger, more whole, our minds a testament to your healing power. The world can be a challenging place, Father. There are forces at play, negativity that seeks to disrupt our peace and steal our joy. Sometimes we feel vulnerable, exposed like targets in a storm. But you, Lord, are our shield and our defender. In your mercy, extend your protection over us, a sheltering embrace that keeps us safe from harm. We know you are greater than anything that tries to come against us. In the name of Jesus, we choose to trust in your power. We bind every plan of the enemy, any force that seeks to attack us, physically, emotionally, or spiritually. We don't fight this battle alone. We stand with you, Father, cloaked in the armor of your love. Surround us with your hedge of protection, a barrier of light that deflects negativity and keeps us safe from unseen dangers. Grant us the wisdom to discern your voice amidst the noise, the strength to resist temptation, and the unwavering faith to know that we are always walking in your presence. We don't ask to be shielded from life's challenges, Father, but to face them with courage and the knowledge that you are by our side every step of the way. Lord, we stand before you today, humbled by your presence and overflowing with gratitude. We are grateful for every heart here, every soul open and receptive to your love. Together, in this sacred space, we come in agreement a united front against the challenges that life throws our way. In the name of Jesus, we claim victory. Victory over illness, over doubt, over anything that tries to dim our light. We declare healing and restoration, not just for ourselves, but for every broken piece of our lives. May your healing touch mend fractured relationships. Your wisdom guide us through difficult decisions, and your love be the foundation upon which we rebuild. We don't pray alone, Father. We lift up our loved ones, those precious souls who hold a special place in our hearts. Bless them, Lord, as you have blessed us. Shower them with your healing power, surround them with your protection, and guide them with your unwavering light. May they experience your love and mercy in every aspect of their lives a constant reminder that they are never truly alone. As we close this prayer, let's carry this sense of unity, this strength in numbers with us throughout our days. May we continue to support one another, to lift each other up in prayer, and to walk hand in hand on this journey of faith. Father, we come before you today overflowing with thanks. Thank you for the gift of the Holy Spirit your constant companion who dwells within us. The Spirit is our guide, a gentle voice whispering wisdom in our hearts, a comforter who eases our burdens and lifts our spirits in times of darkness. Help us, Lord, to be more attuned to this divine guidance. Make our hearts sensitive to the nudges of the Holy Spirit, that we may walk with obedience and purpose on the path you have laid out for us. And as we walk that path, we know we are not alone. Your healing touch, Father, is a constant presence in our lives. We reach out to you today, seeking that healing in all the places where we are broken, physically, emotionally, and spiritually. We praise you, God, for the countless miracles of healing you orchestrate, big and small each one a testament to your deep love and the unwavering care you have for each of your children. You see our struggles, you hear our cries, and you reach out with a healing hand. 
For yours is the kingdom, the power, and the glory, forever and ever. May we continue to walk in the light of your love, guided by the Holy Spirit, forever grateful for your presence in our lives. Thank you, Lord, for hearing and answering my prayer in the mighty name of Jesus. I pray, Amen. If this prayer resonated with you, if it touched your heart in some way, feel free to type Amen in the comments below. It's a beautiful way to connect with others who found comfort in these words. I truly believe the blessings we pray for have a ripple effect. So, if you feel called to share this message with someone who might need it, a friend going through a tough time, a family member seeking strength, please share this video. Every like, every share, helps spread the message of hope and love. And for even more inspiration, consider subscribing to our channel, Miracle Jesus Prayers. We upload regularly, offering prayers to uplift your spirit and bring peace to your heart. Your support means the world to us. Remember, you are blessed to be a blessing, a light for others in this world. If you have a prayer request, a specific burden on your heart, feel free to leave it in the comments. We believe in the power of community prayer, and with your permission, we'll lift your request before God, asking for His blessings and victory in your life. And who knows, maybe viewers from all over the world, right here on YouTube, will join us in praying for you right now. So let's stand together in faith. May the grace and peace of our Lord Jesus Christ be with you all. Amen.